bump, bump, bump. On the road this morning, heading back north towards Flagstaff and then west. Hello fellow RVers, this is Gary once again with Rough Road RV Life. We like looking to freedom, got freedom, freedom, got Sharon behind the camera. So where's freedom brought us? Well, we are in a city called Seligman, Arizona, and we are at a KOA journey. And we, uh, it's off of, right off of I-40, so it was handy for us. This is just a one night stopover for us on our way to Lake Havasu. So uh, we did a little video walk about of this park for you to see. It's a nice park. You got, um, you got a combination here of pull throughs. Uh, I think there may be some back ends over there. I'm not sure, but um, no, they all pull throughs. I think they all might be pull throughs. I think they're all pull throughs. A variety of services. Variety of services: 50 amp, 30 amp, some 30 amp, some have sewer, some just have water and electric. Our site here, F6, has um, 50 amp water and sewer. But it's a gravel site, we got plenty of room, uh, nice and level, all the sites look level. They do have two dog parks, they have a nice swimming pool, they have a store with a gift shop and you can get snacks in there, um, ice cream, stuff like that. They do have games in there that you can get for kids, I think, or whatever they are, they do advertise games. They have horseshoes. There's no real trails around here, bike riding is just what you see here or anything like that. But it, it's a nice area to walk. I mean, it's big enough that you can get a good dog walk. Yes. And um, plus the parks. Plus the parks. The uh, pet parks. Pet recreation. What do they call them? I don't know. Pet kit. I don't know what they are. <laughs> anyway, uh, they have some cabins here. They also have a teepee, which you can rent if you want to live in a teepee. Tent sites over here. So um, it was a pretty nice one night stop for us. Gave us a chance to get our laundry caught up. If we're on our way to Lake Havasu. I can't. I think that's they. They have a the, the uh, Verizon service here was was pretty good for us. They do have a park Wi-Fi. I did not hook into their Wi-Fi, so I don't know about it. But they do advertise a Wi-Fi system. So with all that being said, well, you are pretty close to the little town of Seligman, Seligman, if I'm saying that correctly, and it is considered the birthplace of Route 66 because this little town. Um, has the longest original portion or something like that. Um, I just learned about that after we got here. So, little trivia for you there. There might be some Route 66 if you're a Route 66 fan in this area. Right. Might be some uh, history around. All right, so we're, so we're going to do a little walk around video here and let you see what it's about. Our tour starts here at the big dog park at the Seligman Route 66 KOA nice big park they do have a little park on the other side of the park so here's a view of the campground from the dog park Sites are adequate. Some have shade. They do have a cabin for rent. And that building straight ahead is the office. And there's the playground. And behind that white fence right there is a pool. Most inviting pool, but when we got here it was light and it was cool. Well, it was later in the day. Horseshoes right there and a playground. The one thing you will have to be okay with here, trains. Not one train, not two trains. How many trains? A thousand. <laughs> one right after the other. It is almost uh, non-stop. Here's a look at the tent areas. They're around the perimeter. And the RV spots are pull through. Nice big picnic table, grill. They assign you your spot.
And there is a look at the cabin with a swing. My dad made a little swing like that. Mmm, roses and I can smell them, but there's a pool. Nice, nice pool. We would definitely get in that if we were going to be around here today. Bathrooms. Office with ice cream and camping supplies and... Laundry. Yes. And laundry. And another playground. Yeah, t-shirts. Looks like they sell propane. Well, right over there, you can get beer, wine, and liquor to go. That's the entrance right there, conveniently located off of I-40. And more cabins. And it looks like if you want to stay in a teepee, you can. Dirt and gravel sites. We had no problem leveling, though. Those are cute cabins. They really are. That one's K3. Historic Route 66. Oh, it has a deck and everything. More tent sites on this side. And the RV park is that way. That's a B row. Have mountains off in the distance. And this morning, the temperature's rather cool, wouldn't you say? Yeah, it was pleasant. Yeah, it's downright okay. <laughs> I think the days are 80s, maybe low 90s, and nights are 50s, 60s, when I was looking at the forecast. And here's the other part. Pet playground number two, along with the pet etiquette rules. <laughs> what is that, Luna? You just want to go in there and smell. It's a pet walk area out here. Definitely like all the pet areas. We're around the corner, back to our spot at what are we? F6, right? F6. See, I love it. Plenty of room. That was our little video of a uh, video walk around of the uh, KOA journey right off of I-40, Seligman, Arizona. One thing this park has is trains. Right there, big trains. And those trains, I have never seen so many trains run up and down a track. They go both ways, but they run all night. Uh, you can hear them if you're, if you're a train person. Or trains bother you? You're gonna hear trains. Those are big trains. <laughs> so uh, rumbly they, they trains. Some trains here. I was like, oh cool! <laughs> I can watch the trains. I like trains. And in the middle of the night, <laughs> you just hear trains. <laughs> well, anyway, today is um. It's August, not a deal breaker. Not no, a deal breaker. Not for no. us. Uh -uh. Today's August 28th. It's about 11 o'clock. We got to check out here at 11 o'clock. It's like 10:30 because we're on our way to Lake Havasu. Two and a half hour run, and. Uh, Looking forward to getting there. It's a waterfront, so can't wait to see what that's about. But anyway, follow us on our journey. Click like and subscribe. Gary and Sharon, Rumford RV Life. We like looking at freedom. Safe travels.